It's time to get back in touch with your BlackBerry Messenger friends from 2008. I'm Bridget Carey, and this is your CNET Update. BlackBerry Messenger has always been a very popular messaging tool between BlackBerry users, but now the service is coming to Android and iOS devices as a free app. The apps for iOS and Android will be coming sometime in the summer, and BlackBerry is also taking on Twitter by launching BlackBerry Messenger channels, where users can create a profile and follow other people and brands, just like on a social network. Users can comment and click like on a post, but there's also the option for private one-on-one -on -one chatting. It's launching in beta, and there will be a few high-profile accounts at launch, including Alicia Keys. And in other BlackBerry news, if you're a BlackBerry loyalist waiting for the new BlackBerry Q10, that's the one with the physical keyboard, it's finally coming to the U.S. next month in June. Verizon and T-Mobile said the Q10 will be in stores by June, and Verizon will start taking pre-orders in the coming weeks. Sprint's going to be selling the Q10 in late summer. The phone was first introduced more than three months ago, so the BlackBerry faithful in the U.S. sure have had to wait patiently for any details. But as for the all-touch screen Z, 10. It's getting a small software update over the next few days that will add Skype video chat as well as a few other perks like getting to customize alerts and ringtones for different contacts, better control for moving the cursor while typing, and new camera modes and photo editing options. But if Windows Phone is more your style, Nokia just announced the metal-bodied Lumia 925. It's coming to the U.S. with T-Mobile sometime in July. It's thin and super light compared to other Lumia phones. This is going to be the flagship phone in the Lumia line. It has 4G LTE support, a 4.5-inch display, and the same 8.7-megapixel camera with image stabilization as its sister models. There's another Lumia coming Thursday to Verizon, the Lumia 928. It has a plastic body, but it's thinner than its counterpart at AT&T. It costs $99 with a two-year contract, and we have the full review of the 928 along with the BlackBerry Q10 now on CNET. And how about a treat to end today's show? Google has programmed a game into the image search. If you type the words Atari Breakout in Google Image Search, the screen turns into the classic game and you can control it with arrow keys. This was added to honor the 37th anniversary of the game and it's a great way to get in trouble at work. Google does a few other tricks if you know the right search phrases. Visit the show blog for a list of a few at cnet.com slash update. Thanks for watching from our studios in New York. I'm Bridget Carey.